Ladies and gentlemen, Banlist, finally, we're just going to dive into it because um, we're probably going to be spoiled otherwise, so I'm just going to do this. <laughs> yes! Yes, I knew it. I called it. I called it. I absolutely called it, by the way. I didn't see anything else, which is great. Now we get to react to the Banlist, finally. It's been a long time coming. And some of the cards here have been really problematic. I'm relatively surprised to see all of these together. But there's something I don't see here, which is Albion, the Sanctifier Dragon, which makes me kind of worried. Let's jump into the live reaction. Fiendsmith's like Rima. I mean, this is a card that I've been calling to just get banned. I don't know if it had to be alongside Beatrice, Lady of the Eternal. At least I didn't expect it to be that way. But to be honest, it, it happened. So Lacrima, horrible card design, burns for time, makes the game just like super awkward. Apollosa, Bow of the Goddess, is... I'm kind of sad to see it go, honestly. Because, you know, I'm just noticing here, there's no, like, there's no actual like Snake Eyes hit. Poplar... And um, Flamberge are not on this list. So Apple, obviously, incredibly powerful card. Just like a powerhouse. But it means that Snake Eye is not completely hit. They just hit a part of the deck. But Lacrima is huge. Hot Red, Dragon, Archfiend, Calamity, awesome. Beatrice, Lady of the Eternal. Great. We all wanted it to go. It was obvious. Let's go on to the limited section. Branded Fusion. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Eva is back. Snake Eye Ash is back. Poplar is back. Gimmick Puppet. Both of them are limited. Branded Fusion is limited. That's, that's what I was suspecting, honestly, because of the fact that Albion wasn't on the list. I thought that this was going to be the case. Opening of the Spirit Gates. Prosperity. Sang and Summoning. Grass. I actually called Grass. That's kind of crazy. I really wanted it to come back. And Skill Drain. So Branded Fusion going to one. Obviously, is going to be the most significant one out of this. Yeah. That is definitely something that... I mean... Yeah. It's, it's sad. It sucks. But it's still going to be fine, I think. Um, but it's definitely gonna gonna turn things around. Branded Fusion finally getting limited. I'm happy the deck is not dead. It's gonna be fine. Ash and Poplar to one. Doesn't do anything, I think. Eva back, Grass back, Prosperity and Sang and Summoning, amazing. Opening of the Spirit Gates, I think it's kind of weird, but Skill Drain to one is awesome. Semi-limited. Blaster Redox Tempest Tidal, Luna Light Tiger, Colossus and Ib. That doesn't really matter. And lastly, Armageddon Knight, Red Rose, Kirin, Plush Fire is back. Ancient Fairy, Dragon, Denglong, and Time Seal. So yeah, this is a, this is a rough one for me personally. Uh, once I saw that Albion the Sanctifier wasn't on this list, I, you, you guys saw that I was worried. I was really worried. Uh, but yeah, this is, this is it. I think this is... Um, Pretty solid ban list. The main problem is, I think, Apo is banned now. So what does Snake Eye actually do? Like, without Lacrima, without Beatrice, one Snake Eye Ash, one Poplar, Bellstar is obviously on hit. What does the deck do? Uh, I think Tenpai is going to be really good. I think Ubel is going to be really good. Grass is back. That's awesome, I think. That's awesome. That's, that's a huge buff for Branded. Uh, obviously, it's going to take me some time to process this. <laughs> but this is going to be my honest reaction. I think semi-limited and, and unlimited. Let's just go over deck by deck. Snake Eye. I think people are going to be really mad because the deck was not hit enough. I think banning Apo is the same as like Baron, Linkaribo, Savage. It's just hitting around the deck. They're just hitting around the deck. Lacrima, awesome. Hot Red, awesome. Beatrice, great. But Snake Eye is like really good still. Ubel, 
is still going to be pretty solid, like even with one opening of the spirit gates. It's still going to be really solid, like all the engine is pretty intact. Gimmick puppet stuff, that's good. Eva back, I don't think it's going to do anything, to be honest, with, especially with Beatrice hit. Um, Prosperity and Sanguine Summoning are hits to freaking Tenpai, but it's not enough. Especially when Rage of the Abyss comes out and Skill Drain 1 is, is awesome. Things that weren't addressed on this list, Shifter, not addressed whatsoever. And I think probably that's the, the biggest thing, that Shifter is just like still out there. Thank you so much for watching. We gotta cook. See you guys.